It's a dating show with a twist. Labor of Love not only follows a woman's mission to find love, but also a partner in motherhood. And one of the producers of the show lives right here in Las Vegas. Mike Davis learned more about the new hit reality show. I suggest we just get right to the task. <laughs> <laughs> what better way to start this journey than to find out if you're capable of creating a child? Labor of Love is much more than the reality dating show you're used to. This time, TV dating is changing the narrative as Labor of Love centers on Christy Katzman, a 41-year-old woman wanting to start a family with a loving partner. It's a different reality TV experience for Christy, who appeared on season 11 of The Bachelor franchise. You know, I think I never thought I'd do a show again, but when Labor of Love came around, it honestly is my life. And I think I kind of knew, hey, if I have this opportunity, like I'm going to, I'm going to say yes. You know, this is a story that needs to be told. This could be a way for me to become a mom. It's a concept that was birthed by personal challenges to have a baby. I want for my birthday present for mommy to get pregnant and have a baby. Producer and Las Vegas resident Marklin Kennedy already shared a child with his wife Carrie, but they wanted another baby. Right, we exhausted everything. We went through every single thing, and even to the point before we ended up going to Mexico, we had done everything from uh, witch doctors and shamans and potions and listening to old wives' tales where some everybody had something to say. They wanted to document the journey, and boy, was there a lot to document. 2,678 prenatal vitamins, 236 fertility drug injections, 65 ovulation detection tests, 89 blood draws, 36 ultrasounds, 27 pregnancy tests, 29 embryos to confirm, and ultimately seven miscarriages. It was so emotional and painful, they stopped sharing with friends and family that Carrie was pregnant. But they were determined and did not stop. And now, 10 years later, their journey has morphed into Christie's own story. More importantly, they have Grayson, a six-year-old boy with the awesome nickname of Queso. Sure, the story being told is entertaining, but there's also an important message of hope that local doctor Joseph Adeshek, who specializes in high-risk pregnancies, believes will come from the show. I think the show is awesome. I think 41-year-old for our practice is actually on the younger side. I mean, women, you know, these days, they always think they hit 35 years old and now they're too old to have babies and it's nothing like that. I think if they get past the aspect that it seems like it's a dating show, I think it's gonna affect people's lives that it will give them hope because it's never too late. There are enough options that if everybody tells you you can't do it, you might be in the percentage that you can't do it. And that's why there's amazing things like a job adoption. And for those watching at home, sharing the experience and feeling the same emotions, Christy has some advice. And I think what you need to do is be open to a different story. You know, had I not been open-minded, I wouldn't have this opportunity. If I had given up when things didn't work out the first time, I would not have this opportunity. So I think it is still possible to pursue motherhood. You do have to be aware of realities, but I think you also have to be willing to be open to a different way to get what you want. Oh, best of luck to Christy. And you can tune into Labor of Love tonight at 9 right here on Fox 5.